there was, I think, one got recycled due to a medical issue. We had one person get kicked out because he lied about having asthma. We had people that had to drop out of the Air Force completely because of mental stability. So I think we lost about four, four or something people, but beyond that, everyone else passed. Then what four? We had a couple people who got actually sent home due to either a mental illness or some sort of panic attack from BMT and being stressed out. We had a lot of people recycled into our flight. They were washed back a couple weeks due to zero tolerance stuff and eventually were kicked out from that. During basic training, we only lost three people and every time we lost someone, it was like losing a brother. It was the worst thing ever. So we had someone who just quit. He just, he was done. He was tired, exhausted. We had another person, he was suicidal. That was a thing. He would drink cologne and he just wasn't having a good time. And then the third one, he got out because of medical reasons. He, he got hurt and he pushed himself too hard. We only lost three people and I know that's really low for an average flight to lose three people, but Every time we lost someone, it, it was just terrible. We were really close as a flight. Three, two from our initial flight. First guy, I think it was a medical discharge, uh, nothing special. Second guy though, ended up squaring up with our MTI in the chow line. He was trying to do a right flank into like getting the food when dorm chief posted him and kept on not being able to do it. Our MTI kept having to redo it, having to redo it. And he ended up squaring up with him and then just leaving the chow hall. So he got recycled into a different flight, and then from what I've heard, I don't know personally, tried to fight a guy in that flight, and so he ended up getting like out of the Air Force. Third guy, he got into our flight because he was on med hold for a while. I don't know what happened to him. I've heard some things, but I don't actually know, so I'm not gonna speak on that. We did get a guy recycled into our flight, though, for on the uh, fourth week call, going on Snapchat. Someone busted him for that. Uh, so he got recycled into our flight. He's a great guy now. He's like, he's over there, actually. Yeah, so he got recycled into our flight, but three, two from our initial flight, and one came in, so yeah. So total, we had three people get recycled in our flight. And the first one was like second week, cause she like was complaining about her ankle hurting and then went to med hold. And then I think we saw her again, like two weeks later in some other flight. So she got recycled a couple times. Um, the other two girls, actually failed their PT test, the last PT test six week. And one of them actually didn't get to go to beach with us either. She went to med hold cause she <laughs> is on a Sunday and she hit her knee on her security door and like cut her knee open. And like the medical had to come up and like do stitches in the dorm. And she didn't get back to like 3 AM that night from the emergency room. So that sucks. And then, so yeah, she didn't get to go to beach with us. And then she graduated a week later. The funny thing is they're both here with me at Keesler and they literally live like two doors away from me. So I thought that was kind of funny, but also cool that they're here. We did have one training recycle. He did a couple of things. He came out of bed one night and was looking, joking around with one of his friends and slapped him on the face and turned out it was a different kid. And he wasn't too happy about that. Uh, he did a couple of other things like talking behind people's backs, a couple of things that you shouldn't have been saying, but in the end, we all became really good friends with him. We understood it. it. Wasn't that big of a deal to us, but he had to go, unfortunately. Being recycled in BMT is a really big thing. There are people that do really dumb stuff, something small that could add up or something big. Um, personally, in my flight, nobody got recycled, which is a great thing. I graduated with my whole flight. As far as people getting recycled in my flight, we did have a lot of drama. We had some people who were in serious trouble and they were about to get recycled. They were passing us to brother flight and stuff like that. They actually didn't end up getting recycled, but we did have a girl get recycled over her PT test. And then we had some girls go to med hold for like mental reasons and things like that. We actually had one girl who was like really missing home and she didn't want to be there. And then next thing you knew, she was getting picked up by an ambulance. So it's pretty crazy. Mm -hmm.